precious special blended Scotch whisky by John Walker and Sons, Royal Warrant Holder, was drawing some attention at Royal Loch Nagar Distillery near Balmoral earlier today. It's 60 years to the day since Her Majesty the Queen acceded to the throne, and a fitting date for the special edition Diamond Jubilee by John Walker and Sons to be bottled. John Walker and Sons were first awarded the Royal Warrant in 1934 by King George V. And, and it's something that we feel very proud of. It's a, it's a real endorsement of quality. And so to continue that royal connection and find an appropriate way to celebrate what is an extraordinary anniversary, we feel very proud to have been able to do that. What makes this limited edition so unique is that every aspect of its creation has particular significance to the Diamond Jubilee. The whiskies were distilled in 1952, which was the year of the Queen's accession to the throne. And those whiskies are extremely rare. We make sure that they're blended in the right proportions to give this wonderful flavour. Oak from the Queen's Sandringham estate was used to handcraft the casks in which the blend was married. This really just allows them all to intermingle and adds an extra layer of character with, with some, of, some character coming from the wood of the cask. From the diamond-shaped Baccarat crystal decanter to the intricate Britannia silver adornments by Hamilton and Inches, the making of Diamond Jubilee has thrown a spotlight on traditional craftsmanship and excellence. I'm a hand engraver. The trade itself is, is a very old one and becoming increasingly rare. Each job I do is unique and brings the piece that I'm working on to life, and gives it each a, a specialness, a one-off. A bespoke cabinet by N.E.J. Stevenson made from oak and pine from the Queen's private estates will house the special edition, which includes two hand-engraved Cumbria crystal glasses and a commemorative book featuring the stories of the craftsmanship behind it. Traditional craftsmanship is what we're all about. So we're delighted through the donation of the profit from Diamond Jubilee to be able to support other craftspeople in their fields. The first decanter will be a gift for the Queen, followed by 60 other editions to be sold by John Walker and Sons for £100,000 each, with the profits donated to Quest, the Queen Elizabeth Scholarship Trust to support craftsmanship. We launched our Diamond Jubilee appeal essentially so that we could increase the number and value of scholarships that we're able to award. The John Walker and Sons heritage will last for generations to come helping talented craftsmen and women to be their best.